Good morning. Uh, I will here to discuss the uh, comparison between VDR and SVDR or the simplified voyage data recorder. I will go into explain the purpose, information, and the or how how they are works. Also, the data that uh, you can be able to see with them. This is a closed eye oral recitation, so I need to close my eyes as I've stated the information regarding these two. So, VDR uh, are used on board the vessel. Uh, for uh, investigation purposes because it record the or what is happening on the bridge uh, it also records the movement because it have uh, sensors there are two types of VDR the VDR itself for the voyage data recorder and the what they so called uh, SVDR or the simplified voyage data recorder um, and they, they, are, they are the same aside that the VDR has lots of information con, con, compare with the SVDR which only uh, obtain the primary or the important information with regards to navigation you know using VDR you can you can be able to determine the root, the root cause of the the root cause of the uh, of the incident in uh, maritime industry uh, th this was just reviewed by the authority and and the result will take uh, immediately they will uh, they will they will be able to know the root cause uh, as soon as possible so the main purpose of vdr and svdr uh, is to record uh, data uh, on ship in in critical man in critical parameters so about the information between the VDR and SVDR uh, I can say that na, they are almost uh, the same uh, the difference was that the information you will be able to see on the VDR is uh, more plenty uh, other than the SVDR which is information is less uh, because that's why the SVDR is uh, cost effective uh, this was used by the small vessel uh, for example fishing vessel uh, as they don't need uh, the lots of data but VDR uh, when we talk about the operation uh, the SVDR and VDR are the same uh, they, they they were uh, recording the data uh, every 12 hours and after the 12 hours uh, it was the overwritten and and if there is an uh, accident happen, for example, there is a collision, uh, the data persists uh, one month or 30 days. Uh, now, we, let's talk about the data. Uh, as, as I've said earlier, the data the information you you can obtain from the vdr uh, is, is uh, more plenty uh, other than the svdr so their data is 
the same uh, the only difference is that the VDR uh, has lots of data and I will go into to recite uh, all the data that you, you will be able to see with them uh, let's start with SVDR so SVDR you will be able to see the date and time the ship's position uh, according to electrical position system or the CPS uh, you will also be able to, to, to see the speed over ground and the speed uh, rather uh, speed through water uh, also the heading of the compass the bridge audio and the AIS uh, radar data and other other data that uh, you may be able to see when you are interfacing it and lastly the VDR that has the abundant data uh, you, you, the data you can be able to record in the PDR uh, in, includes the date and time, ship's position, bridge audio, uh, the heading from the compass, speed over ground, speed through water, um, bridge communication using the VHF. Radar or alpha alpha display, egg this display, uh, the datum or the water depth coming from the echo sounder, uh, the main alarm like the general alarm, fire alarm or the engine room alarm, uh, rather rather angle uh, orders, uh, rather angle indicator. Um, all uh, uh, orders and uh, engine engine orders and boat thruster also the hull opening uh, wind speed direct wind speed and direction coming from the anemometer and the AIS data Moreover, the rolling motion, um, con configuration data, and that's really electronic lagging.